my name is Pam. I'm one of the naturalists here at Long Lake. And today we are out in nature doing some tracking. And this is something that you can do anywhere out in nature, um, along a dirt road, al along um, just the side of, or even in your yard, you can find animal tracks. The best time to find them is probably after a, a rain or looking for spots that are moist to find them. Today it's it's a little dry. It has been, it hasn't rained, but we did find some really cool deer tracks. So you can make an animal track that looks like this. And the only thing that you're gonna need for this is you can get plaster Paris, which you can find at the hardware store, water, a plastic bowl for mixing, a plastic spoon, mine is just from the Dairy Queen, and that's it, things for mixing. All right, so, oh, and salt. You might need some salt. I have a tip for you that when you're doing your plaster cast, it takes about a half an hour to an hour to dry, or you can leave it overnight. But a tip for you to make it go faster is that you can add just a pinch of salt to the plaster of Paris. Now the plaster of Paris also already has something called crystallized water in it. and and they've also added water. And so just adding that pinch of salt to the plaster of Paris, the salt will absorb all of that extra water that's already in there. And the drying process will be faster. I'm upon a really nice deer track right here. And I'm just gonna reach down in here and take out just the pieces that I don't want to be in my track, like this really nice seed from a tree and try to clear out the things that you don't want being careful not to ruin the track. Now, to make your track um, come out more even, some people prefer to, like if you're on the trail, some people prefer to just pour the plaster right in and, and leave it like that so it has a more natural kind of edgy to it. But you can use just a, a plastic ring from any kind of container. And if you don't have a plastic ring and you're out in the forest, you can use just a, a ring of birch bark just like this. So I'm going to try that with the birch bark today. I'm just going to put my ring right around here. So I'm just going to try it this way, put it right inside there. I'm mis mixing two parts of plaster of Paris with one part of water and you want to mix it fairly quickly because it does start to set up right away so I'm going to just mix it with my plastic spoon ah, and it might splash a little bit you're out in nature mix it up really quick so that it's filled in there all even out and it might leak out just like that, and that's okay. Trying it with birch bark. We are going to leave this just like this for at least 30 minutes to up to an hour, and then come back. And we're gonna, I'll show you how to take out your track. All right, so I'm gonna show you how you would Take the take your track out. You would very gently like take a tool or something and scrape around and make sure that it comes out. And then you would take and brush off any dirt that's on there. And then there's your track. So tips that you can do, you can leave your track just set as it is and you can keep like polishing it up and, and or you can leave little bits of dirt on there so that it looks like it just came right out of the earth or what you can also do is you can choose to paint it or decorate it any way that you want with markers and put the date on the back and the type of track that you found and keep it as a, as a keepsake or keep a collection of tracks animal tracks that you have seen throughout the whole entire summer happy tracking all right, so we've stopped by to see how our track is doing. I'm just going to take a stick here and go around it and dig out some of it. It looks like it's hardened and coming out. And it came out all in one piece. It's going to look like this. You might want to have to take, again, find a toothbrush and wipe off all of the 
dirt. My birch bark, it looks like it can just be ripped right off of there. And there's my track. So very cool. And this will all just come like parts that I don't want in here. I'm just going to take it and pull those off.